Hey guys, it's Erica. We are going to be checking out NCT Dream. Tico told a man, be there for you. Lyr live clip. Almost said lyric video. This is a live clip. Live vocals from NCT. I've seen 127 live, not Dream. But anyway, I mean, some of them go be. The, some of them I have seen live, but um, the members, I guess. Vocals. I've heard, but my own ears in person. Anyways, I'm very excited to be checking this out. Um, so, what I mainly think, just in general, NCT slash Wavy, I don't really think ballad, you know, sort of vibes of songs because I feel like when I think of it, I, I think they do tend to lean more R&B if they're doing those sort of songs. And then also, I just think of like th their title tracks, upbeat, craziness, funness. You know what I mean? Um, so yeah, but there sort of is now this sort of focus on vocals and stuff, which I'm cool with. I already know they're amazing vocalists. SM has some of the best vocalists in the game, um, if not all of the best, excuse me. Um, but yeah, it's very interesting to see this sort of go for this direction after Resonance. Um, even though they did like hot sauce, you know what I mean? Which is like screaming in the chorus. Um, but yeah, very, very just like interesting. And I know they have great singers because Heytron's in there, you know what I mean? And stuff. So yeah, and he, it's just, he just stands out as vocalist, but um, and he's in this one too as well as the script. So yeah, but anyways, slightly awkward intro, but it's me. So what do you expect? You know, with it, let go. I was playing piano. Oh, okay. He can sing and play piano. I like that it's also live with the live piano from them. Great vocals. Great vocals. I said so. I just need you to be with me mm -hmm. As time goes on, we're turning His voice hits you like that, like it pushes you back Is it only three of them in the song? Vocals. Amazing. I got lost in just his singing, girl. I always wanna be there for you, and I know that you will feel the same. Let me live. Let's go. Okay. 
안돼 지금처럼만 I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that. That was really nice. Imagine full all NCT vocalist <laughs> in one song. That's really weird, right? Because like, I think Hedgehog's the most identifiable as lead vocalist for NCT because his voice very much stands out. I mean, all of their voices stand out, but just like his, he always gets the big notes in most of the songs and stuff. Like Taeyeol does here and there. Um, and I think Doyoung's an amazing vocalist too as well. But, and then like Ten also had the one part in 90s love where I was just like, Ten, oh my God, vocals. Um, so it was very interesting to think of like, who is technically the vocal, like main vocal line of NCT because Again, think of Ten, I think Dancer, but man has a voice. He has a voice and stuff. Um, so I think like if they did like a mini album or a new subunit of NCT where it was just like a ballad, like Super Junior KRY style. Um, Cause even, I just ranked it to Wavy's, uh, Kun and Xiao Jun. They had a ballad sort of thing that they released too as well. Um, so just who was a, they're all, like 20 out of the 23 members are all vocalists and stuff. Um, but, yeah, very, very, very interesting. That'd be, I would, I would like that. I would appreciate that SM Entertainment if you are watching this, which they are not watching this video. If there would be a subunit of NCT that would just be strictly vocals and strictly focused on ballads, like Super Junior KRY. But um, I really enjoyed it. Uh, just bruh, bruh, vocals, girl, vocals, just vocals, like vocals, vocals is all I can say great vocalist. <laughs> it's a really great song. I really enjoyed it too as well. I like the live little clip of it. Amazing live vocals. That's the other thing. SM has always had amazing vocalists, but the live vocals, live, like if you see like SNSD, Taeyeon live vocals or like EXO live vocals, they're always insane. Like it's, it's craziness. And Wendy's last mini or her mini album debut, like insane vocals. Like it's just like, I think because they have write most of their songs to get, well, I think X is a little bit of an exception. They write most of their songs to sort of make them like fit the group itself. But then when they do their solo stuff, it's just like, they just, it unlocks a whole nother part of them. Like I feel that with Wendy. I didn't really feel that with Taylor because Taylor was always doing crazy vocalist sort of things, but her solo stuff definitely expanded on that somewhat. Um, and I, I don't feel that with EXO because I feel like, Dio and Baekhyun and Chen too as well have always had really big vocal moments in EXO songs so their solo stuff didn't necessarily surprise me as much. Like with Baekhyun stuff his like dancing surprised me more than the vocals. I mean vocals still got me girl. They still got me. Oh my god especially the R&B songs. Oh my god. But um, it still felt very fitting for what all of the EXO songs you know what I mean. Like um but yeah but I just they just bruh but just vocals the takeaway from this is just vocals and i loved it great and live vocals live that was live can you believe that just and i love that again he was playing the piano for the tube as well so it was all completely a live sort of thing it wasn't like a backing track and he was just he was he would go in town on piano multi-skilled multi-talented nct members they're all so versatile oh my god Go to Pure Thoughts and comments down below what you thought about NCT Dreams. Be there for you. Live clip. If you like this video, give this video a thumbs up. If you liked me and you want to see more of my videos, go to hit that subscribe button. If you want to see my videos the second they come out, hit that notification button. If you want to follow me on social media, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, TikTok, or in the description down below, or at the end screen, share this video with your friends. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Love you, and I'll tell you guys later. Bye.